appreciate you guys. Thank you. Rohit, do you have a question for our panel? Yes, thank you. Thank you for giving me the opportunity. I would like to ask the panel, uh, what advice would you like to give someone considering joining Toastmaster? Uh, I know that there are so many questions people have in their mind. I can relate to myself, but what advice as a seasoned Toastmaster would you like to give to the person considering to join? Sure, Mario. Uh, the, the, the question that I was at, would ask him is, first of all, the reason why they want to join Toastmasters. Uh, there's got to be something uh, that is driving them to come through that door uh, at the meeting the very first time. And, uh, it's a powerful motivator. Sometimes many, many of us don't really appreciate why we come through that. Uh, we could be at the crossroads of our lives. We could be uh, at something that we're going to be fixing, like doing a wedding toast. Uh, you know, and we're all kind of uh, feeling anxious about it. That will drive us through that uh, through that door. But that would be the, the most critical question that I would ask. And then, what do they see themselves later? the process of achieving and becoming. Uh, and that will kind of give you uh, a very good understanding, not you like me, but you as the person walking through that door, it will give that person a good understanding of the reasons why they came in. Because they will articulate that to you. Uh, and they will, they will actually at that point realize, aha, that's the goal that I want to achieve. And that will set the driving force for them. Well, for me, as a newer Toastmaster, joined, uh, joined earlier this year, I would have to say, the best thing to, I would say to, an, to someone that's considering it is come to the meetings. You're allowed to visit free for, for, for three times. And to me, why not? Because that's, that's so much value right there. And it lets you see if the club is an energetic fit for you, uh, mental, mental and psychological, uh, get, give you a feel for the people and the and what they, what you can bring to them and vice versa, and that's what I love is that you can visit any club more, like three times, and there's not there's not a lot of places, well any place that I'm aware of that you can visit three times and try it on, and enjoy it uh, before actually taking part and joining on. So that's that was a, a huge selling point for me. That I was able to try and try them, try out Hilltop. So thank you. I share with people that Toastmasters is the least expensive personal growth program in the world, and I have done everything. And with that, it gives open you know open yourself up. And I know when I started, it was all about me and where it led to all about you. And it's a way of just doing personal growth on any level wherever you're at. It's as simple as that for me. Yeah, the advice I would give to somebody who is considering to join the Toastmasters Club, like Nike says, just do it. Because <laughs> <laughs> the biggest regret anybody has when they join a Toastmasters Club is that they didn't do it 10 years earlier. Absolutely. 